Hey guys, so I'm gonna do a get ready with me um, and just chat with you guys. I desperately need to do a makeup video right now, I feel. Um, with everything that's going on, I haven't put any makeup on my face. And I just did my hair for the first time. I'm not going anywhere. I am quarantining myself, social distancing, you know, all that good stuff. But I wanna film and um, I wanna put some makeup on. It just helps me feel, um, a bit normal. I'm gonna put these eye drops in. Um, these are by Bausch & Loam Lumify. I got these on Amazon a while ago. And I rarely use them, but they're supposed to like take all of the red out of your eyes and just make your eyes look really bright. So let's start there. You know, my eyes are a little bloodshot from <laughs> crying. I actually have only cried once. I like really tried to cry today, but my Emotions, I don't know, let me know if you're with me, but my emotions feel so flat. But I like literally tried to cry today. It was, it was like one of those things where I was like, it didn't come. Um, yeah, let's just, let's just start. Let's just start having a good time. So I really had to like, um, I'm using the Charlotte Tilbury Light Wonder. Everything's going to be linked below, but I really have to like take a break from Twitter right now at least just not consume it as much as I normally do but just because like there's a lot of like news circulating on on Twitter and most of it's not new news but it's kind of just like same stuff a lot of scary stuff so I have my boyfriend just you know we have a deal where I'm like you fill me in on anything important um, because I'm finding actually he ordered me to to stop <laughs> because every like literally I'd wake up and I'd be like I'll already be like 50 scrolls deep and I'm like did you hear um, but it's hard because Twitter is also where I get a lot of laughs sometimes like I love Instagram but sometimes it's just a little too positive for me for instance you know that that video that's circulating of all the celebrities singing imagine you know, Twitter's making fun of that. And then you go on, on Instagram and people are like, this is so cute. I just, yeah, I'm one of the, I'm with Twitter on this one. Uh, that was super cringe. I felt really embarrassed. I'm gonna use on um, the L'Oreal True Match concealer. Um, and honestly, like, no hate. If you thought that was cute, like, I'm not making fun of you. I'm making fun of them. For having the audacity but yeah I just don't have it in my blood or my bones to like ever see something like that and be like oh my god this is amazing <laughs> so I kind of need Twitter to keep me sane because I really just love making fun of things even me make fun of me all day I'm like I love it I'll join you um, I just can't be that serious oh my god look how cute this necklace is this is from Missouri and my grandmother, so my birthday is in a few days. What's today? I don't even know anymore. My birthday is in six days. Well, from when you're watching this, I don't know. My birthday's on the 26th. I got it in the mail two days ago, but it's so funny because I had no idea my grandmother was sending me something from Missouri. And so when I got it, um, you know, Missouri has gifted me quite a few things, like pretty much all the jewelry I wear. So when I got it, I was like, Thanks, Missouri. I literally posted on Instagram, like, hashtag gifted. <laughs> Sorry. And then, like, immediately, so my mom apparently, like, ordered it for my grandmother because my grandmother, like, does not know how to use the internet. Um, so my mom, like, got a notification and it was delivered. And my mom texted me, like, you got your gift from my mom? I was like, no. I was like, no, but Missouri sent me this lovely necklace. And then it was like, oh, my God. And so I, like, quickly deleted the Instagram post it was only up for like two seconds, but I'm like, how humiliating. Missouri would have been like, uh, you're welcome, bitch. You're insane. They probably would have thought I like sent myself a necklace and was like, thanks, Missouri. <laughs> oh, yeah, it was for my grandmother. So no offense to Missouri because like I love their stuff, but like it's a lot more special that my grandmother sent it to me than if they had just gifted it. Just doing some boy brow. My eyebrows are all healed pretty much from my second microblading appointment and I really, really like them. It's just like soft and natural. But yeah, so that it really sucks that my birthday is in six days and it doesn't look like I'll be able to celebrate. And on one hand, you know, I'm turning 30 and the way I see it is legally, I'm still gonna be 29 until I can celebrate. So 
you know, there's that. Um, but I had a whole thing planned, so I never like make a big deal about my birthday. I never like have a party. Like very, very rarely do I do anything like big. Like I'll have like a few friends over, or I'll like just hang out by myself, and I love it. Um, but this year, because it was my 30th, I was like, I gotta do something big. Sorry, there's somebody like weed whacking outside of my window. Um, even when we're quarantined, I can't, I can't film in peace. Um, I'm just gonna use this uh, milk bronzer. I'm gonna warm it up on my hand and bronze myself to make it look like I've been going outside, even though I have not. Anyway, so I had planned to do something like really big because for my boyfriend's 30th, we rented a cabin in Big Bear with all of our friends and it was so much fun. Um, so I wanted to do that, but because his birthday is in um, October, so it was like colder, um, I thought, well, instead of going mountains, let's go, oh my God, this is so loud, what is going on? I was like, let's do desert. So I rented a house, you know, all my friends chipped in and we got a house in um, Palm Springs. I had never been to Palm Springs despite living in LA for like five years almost. And I was so excited, like all of my closest friends pretty much were going to be there. We There was a pool, a hot tub, like a fire pit outside. It was like a beautiful, beautiful house that we just got for a weekend. Yeah, so we were so excited and then all this happened and obviously there's worse things going on in the world, but I think I'm allowed to be disappointed, you know, and still worried about the fate of everybody else in the world. All right, this looks really patchy, but we're just gonna like, who cares? I think it's the brush, honestly. Maybe I should use a different one. But yeah, I might be making this worse, whatever. Anyway, so, I am fully making this worse. Long story short, I had to cancel it. Oh my God, what am I doing? And I'm gonna like reschedule it, but right now like when, when I'll be able to do that is kind of up in the air because everything's, like there's no, uh, an end point currently on when this is gonna kind of blow over. So <sighs> I'm super bummed. I just wanted to be with my friends and turn 30 and, style so hopefully we'll be able to celebrate sometime this year though it kind of feels silly to celebrate your birthday after your birthday but i guess nothing's normal right now i'm just kind of like talking to myself but out loud to you guys I'm working through this in my head um does that look okay i think there's like some dry patches over here so it's like sticking to it weird but we're gonna move on neutrogena healthy skin blends blush gives a nice pinky hue to the cheeks um wow they're really really being loud doesn't even feel like my birthday no my boyfriend's like are you excited for your presents i'm like mm -hmm. for sure um okay i'm gonna use some of the glossier sky washes when i did the the first video of the sky washes you guys are like i asked you if you wanted me to do more looks with them with the different colors and you guys said yes so i've been playing around with them a lot well mainly with this color palm ended up being my favorite um it's just so pretty like all over the eyes um, but i'm gonna try out a couple just for fun so i'm gonna try some of the more neutrals um but what i have been doing is some like virtual social hangs i've been like i got back into Mario Kart it's like I forgot I had a Nintendo switch because like I really get addicted to it and I have to put it down um, like when I play too much and so for like the past year I hadn't played it. and then um, I got like a text from my brother and all of his friends like want to play Mario Kart tonight and I was like yes and we all like FaceTimed and played on our switches and uh, and it awoke in the beast, let's just say. Um, I've been playing a lot. <laughs> Yesterday, I think I played Mario Kart literally all day. You know, whatever you gotta do to get by. Yeah, so now I'm like obsessed again. I like wake up and I'm like, so I haven't played it yet today. I'm like, just do your hair, film, and then you can play with your friends. But we're gonna get through this, you guys. 
we are going to be fine one day we're just gonna laugh i'm just kidding we're not gonna laugh surprisingly like i don't know maybe it's depression but like i feel like I'm, I'm wearing too much blush am i who cares i've been it's waiting for me to like really have like panic attacks but i haven't it's just kind of like a constant uh discomfort and fear only thing different that i've been doing lately is i've been taking cbd i've kind of been like an infrequent user of or inconsistent user of cbd products um these are the ones i got online but oh my god what is going on verma farms peach cbd gummies um not sponsored i'll link it below i found these off of uh some website i just looked up like what are the good ones um so i've been taking those at night to like help me fall asleep and they really help and um and then i have some like other crap from a dispensary i don't know i have a bunch of weird stuff i don't know maybe that's why because i'm like i know it is supposed to help with anxiety i've never been so consistent with it but i feel like you know I'm, I'm not gonna feel like great because of what's going on like this is like a there's like a situational depression going on but like the anxiety feels pretty even so i don't know maybe it's that i'm gonna try some pebble i haven't used this one yet and it looks really pretty it's like a taupey kind of color i'm just gonna like put it as like a halo hmm it did a little bit of something i think this one's probably more like an all over lid color because it's so like light but i don't hate what what's going on let's try a little valley this is like the peachy one i'm gonna kind of put that in like the same place just for like a little extra like a little creasy little creasy color oh that's pretty i haven't used this one yet either oh no maybe i have i can't remember that's pretty all right you can see the difference um but i'm really glad i have you guys like being in touch on like instagram and still posting videos it's it's nice it's like we need community now more than ever and we're gonna get through it i really like this i'm is it showing up on camera as nice as it is in person okay i'm gonna do echo in just like the outer corner this is like the dark brown i'm using my finger but maybe i'll use a little brush oh i don't have a clean brush but what are we gonna do Mm, these might be better with fingers. I think I really messed it up by using a dirty brush on that. It looks really patchy because it's still it had like powder on it and so it's like mixing the cream with the powder. But from far away it looks pretty good. Um, Alright, I'm not going to make that mistake on the other. Let's see if it looks better. I'm going to try and read a lot of books this year. You know... And I've been, I've been good. I haven't been watching like too much TV, although I have been playing Mario Kart, but we're not counting that, you know, it's like, that's, a, that's a different thing. I started trying to play Stardew Valley last night, but I don't like know how to do it. I need like a tutorial. Yeah. It's a lot better blended without, so don't, don't mix it with powder. Looks better just blended with your finger. Or maybe if I used a clean brush, it would have been better, but I like that. That's all from the sky washes that's cute that's cute okay for mascara i'm gonna use this benefit roller lash my neighbor across the street in an apartment building has the most annoying cough and it doesn't concern me because of what's going on because literally she's been doing this for a year um she has like what sounds like a fake cough i think she's like a weed smoker because i think like it's like the kind of like coughing fit people have after they like smoke weed um 
because I always hear her like cough and then shut her window. So I think she's like smoking out her window. It's literally <laughs> like that's what it sounds like. I'm like, that's not real. But I can literally hear her. My bedroom's in the back of my apartment. She is across the street in the front. And I can hear her with my window shut in my bedroom with a freaking weed whacker outside. I can hear her and her fake cough. Um, this is a beautiful mascara. I'll say it. If you guys wanted to buy my uh, the sky washes or anything else Glossier, my link is in the description. Um, first time customers get 10% off. Um, unfortunately, if you've already purchased through them, you don't get the 10% off. But I do get commission, um, a small amount, when you use my link. And um, every little bit helps right now in this time because everyone's uncertain about what's going on but um but i do appreciate it if you use it but no pressure at all um what should i do for my lips what should i do for my lips what should i do for my lips uh okay here's what we're gonna do i'm gonna do kylie cosmetics lip liner in the shade kylie It's like a brownie nude. I'm gonna like ombre it a little bit. Just a little. This looks really brown on me, but maybe it'll be good. And then I'm gonna take this lip gloss. I got it fairly recently by uh, Laura Mercier in the shade Blush. And these lip glosses are really nice. They like have a good flavor. They have a good color payoff. They're not sticky. I really like them. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, that's pretty. Is it too brown? No, I think it works. Ah, oh, nothing like a fresh set of lacquer on the face. This was fun. Let's do this more. We should do this again. I, it felt like a nice distraction for me to like sit and talk to you guys and put makeup on and play around. So thanks for watching. The sun kind of left me high and dry, I'll be honest. Um, but thanks for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you would like me to keep posting stuff like this as a distraction. And let me know in the comments how the heck you're doing, okay? And I'll see you in my next video.